Developing tonight, Crosley Green will stay in prison. He was just denied parole. Yeah, Green returned to prison in April after being freed. Fox 35's Marie Edinger spoke to his attorney today. Crosley Green's lawyers were hopeful this would be a turning point, that he'd finally be on parole after 32 years in prison, including 19 years on death row, accused of a murder he says he didn't commit. But a parole board had other plans. They did not really give much in the way of a reason. <laughs> Green was out of prison for two years after a federal court ruled he'd been wrongfully convicted. The decision came after the exposure of these documents from police at the original murder scene, where they say they don't think Green committed the murder, but that the victim's girlfriend might have. Here's what Green told me in our one-on-one -on -one interview back in March. I'm not a criminal. I'm an innocent man. I want to have my freedom. But he was sent back to prison this past April when a different court overturned the wrongful conviction decision. His lawyers were hoping he'd be granted parole, arguing he's had a spotless record his entire time in prison and that he did well while he was out too. Four corrections officers and his former warden submitted affidavits supporting his release on parole. It didn't work. He was released for two years. He was a model citizen. He was fully employed, um, went to church every Sunday, fully integrated into his community to be, um, you know, reincarcerated and then denied parole, you know, is, is uh, you know, very, very difficult, especially for his family. The parole board did move Green's presumptive release date up by five years, but it still isn't until 2054. He'll be 97 years old by then. When I last his talked with Green, person, I asked I what he'd want his family to know if he did wind up back in prison. I need y'all to keep moving forward. You know, if you keep moving forward, things going to be OK. His lawyers are taking on the same policy. He has another chance to ask for parole in three years, and his lawyers say they have other things in the works trying to get him out before then. Marie Edinger, Fox 35 News.